I've just finished talking about the rescue jackets, that Sentai jacket, and it kind of got me interested to share with you a lot more of the products that they've got that we can go over. And I think it's really cool. I really like them. They are really decent people. So it was founded in 2014 with Rick and Nick, and they have like they they've absolutely out, outdone themselves with finding some of these products as well as like making them and stuff like that. Which again, I am like wholeheartedly like support them because they are really really decent guys so now some of these are from bandai um so some of them are like really really cool i've already talked about the rescue series jacket which i love i think it is really cool go check out my video on that so some of the other things that i've seen uh, the captain marvelous bracelet now i would probably pick one of these up at some point because i think they look really really cool i already have the other one that they've done, the uh, uh, that's licensed, I missed out on the first run, but the second I saw them put it up, I had to buy one. But looking at this, this is something really cool. I don't know if this would fit me, um, but it would be very interesting. I don't know if it's, I mean, I have ridiculously small wrists, so I don't know if this would fully kind of like fit me, but oh, who knows? Um, but I generally really like it. Um, I think this is really nice. So some of the other stuff that really kind of pops out to me is the like the Abba Ranger stuff. Like I always kind of like their jackets. I think that it's a unique one. Now I don't know if it would be really cool for me to wear one in the UK because it's slightly different, but I would probably wear it on a, a night out or if I was going out with friends. Um, I, I just love the looks of these like jackets. I've always found that when looking at this, this is what stands out, that this is definitely something that would be kind of cool. I probably wouldn't wear it when I was out because apart from like with friends, because I'd just be really worried that someone may spill a drink on it or uh, it may just fall on the floor and people step on it. And I'll be like, no. The Lupin Ranger versus Pata Ranger bracelet. So Lupin X and Pata Ranger X looks really, really nice. I'm guessing that's uh, Rich's uh, hand. But yeah, like look, it's pretty cool. It's awesome. I think this looks really, really nice. To be fair, like I, ne I never got, I never got any of the special stuff from Lupin Ranger versus Pata Ranger. So this is the Lupin X Pata Ranger X uh, No bracelet, and it obviously gives you the obviously the information. Now the Bokanger jackets, right? I kind of like them. Like I'm not a huge fan of Bokanger, but I think like I saw like when I, when I met my one of my best friends. He was wearing the blue jacket and I, it just stands out. Like, Bokanger is obviously Operation Overdrive, the Sentai for that one. Uh, so I never really kind of really liked the jackets. I think the jacket looks really, really cool, especially for like when you can like when you compare it. So I think it's slightly different. So it's just the coloring. But yeah, you can definitely tell it's it looks it looks really, really nice. Like, I think this is something that you could definitely wear on like going out out and about and stuff um and people are like what's that for but like, that's my mother but yeah and really nice like kind of embroidery over it kind of works well like uh search guard uh, search guard successor there's no information like but you can go up to like a medium or large i'm probably a large so the one out of all the scent uh, all the abba ranger jackets my favorite one is the black ranger the brachio one uh, Abra Black. I think it just looks really, really nice. That amount of detail. I think that I, I would like to see more stuff like this come out of like Sentai and you know, maybe this could be a thing, but I just love the artwork. It's, it's one of my favorite ones. This would be the one I probably would go for if uh, I was definitely wearing it because it just looks really, really awesome. So uh, the uh, Kyu Red Vest. So obviously um, modeled by Brendan, who else? I generally think it looked really good. Like I, I wish that uh, Brendan, uh, when he was uh, acting as Tyler, um, would actually wear it. Cause that, that would look really cool on the show. The Zox 2 Kai uh, necklace. Very tempted at picking something like this up um, because I think it would look fantastic. So it's a Bandai release and oh, it's out of stock, damn it. But yeah, like I never realized that they released stuff like that, but look at that. That's really, really, really nice. Now, everyone knows that I really don't like Operation Overdrive. I can't, I can't stand it, but I will say that the jackets look, oh, they are beautiful jackets. This is something that I would wear, you know, going out and stuff like that, because I think, and out of all of them, the yellow one is the one that kind of, stands out to me the the most so obviously claire was the one who modeled this but look how cool this, this jacket is 
I think the only thing that I would change is probably this mesh thing here, but I love the piping on this. Like it looks absolutely fantastic. Oh, you can take the, the arms off. That, that makes it even better. Like, damn, look how cool that, that jacket is. This is one that I would probably get, to be fair. Like, all of it looks really, really cool. Like, oh, that's awesome. Now, I'm, I'm kind of wondering, because if I wore this, would I feel the zip on, on my arms? Like, it's the only, only one. But, oh, you can also take the, it looks like you can take the thingy off. But yeah, I think this looks really, really awesome, to be fair. This is my one of my favorite jackets that they do. Maybe one day, maybe one day I'll be able to uh, buy one. But yeah, I think, yeah, it'd definitely be in, in yellow. I'm hoping that they do it in men's yellow. But yeah, just look at that one. Right, look at that. That's fantastic. Like, I wouldn't put the morpher on there. Like, that's the only thing. So was this, like, uh, is it close the magnetic strap course? Okay, I'll take out the morpher accessory. It's a Geki chopper. I'm very surprised they haven't done one for um, Geki, Geki uh, Violet. But again, this is includes hoodie only. So this is the official Bandai one. So again, like it looks really, really cool. I don't know if I would get this one. I do like the color scheme though. Uh, let's have a quick look. So look at the, like the hoodie. This would, if I did get this, this would just be houseware only. Maybe going to the shop, that would be it. It would only be worn at occasions where I couldn't wear something. But look, oh, the photography on this is really, really nice. I love the what they've done to it. And again, Brendan in, in there as well. So yeah, I, I generally like it. Now this game, this is official Bandai. I don't think I could spend a thousand dollars on this one. Like, what do you get? So ja oh, so you get the pants as well, but it's medium US, so that probably wouldn't fit me yet. Uh, pants size 32, I have no idea. Full uniform. Okay, so I can understand why. Um, this you would only want to get for, like I would say fan films, cosplay and stuff like that. Um, I, I would just literally just, if I bought this, straight in a protective bag stored away to the end of time and maybe I'll occasionally get it out and look at it and go oh that's really nice but yeah I think this looks really really awesome to be fair it's really nice blue and white I think that works perfectly you know doing a quick pose don't do the <laughs> don't do an overarm pose <laughs> damn but yeah that looks really really cool I know this wouldn't fit me at all um I think I probably would have dropped the so I have less space up here to show more of the jacket but yeah look, Brandon looks really young in that photo as well like the SPD badge, like looks pretty awesome. Even the embroideredness, I like. I, I kind of like this, but SPD is definitely not for me. Oh, just look at that. Let's just quickly go back so you can actually have a look more. Any of this will be linked in the description below, so you can see everything. So you can see it. Damn, like they've definitely really done like really cool things. Yeah. So there's just the pants. I, that that probably wouldn't fit me. Um, now, RPM Black, this is something that I think looks really, really cool. Uh, completely out of stock, but you can tell that the, these guys are definitely getting in some of the really good stuff. It'd be interesting to know if they're going to ever bring this back, but this is definitely something I would wear, like, going out. This would be my going out jacket. Like, I, I think this looks fantastic. So, so far, out of all of these, it's the RPM Black uh, leather jacket and the uh, Operation Overdrive. They're definitely ones you could wear out and about. Like, this looks really, really awesome. Like, I love the the kind of, the oh, the elbow pads. Kind of reminds me of being a professor or something. So this is something I would wear if I was going out and about, if I was going to like a, a dinner party. And again, Rich killing it. Uh, look at that, that's really awesome. Definitely like, as much as anyone can turn around and say, like, oh, I don't like Okaidra or whatever. Like, the, the outfits that they wore, spot on. Now, I know that they do the, the jacket, but that's not something. Like, I would wear these, like, weddings and stuff. Like, you know, official Bandai. I would wear that. Like, and again, 250 That's dirt cheap. Like, compared to what we've seen. Now, I've seen the jackets being worn. Um, they, last time I saw this was at uh, the last uh, Palmoff Con I went to. Uh, or the one that was in um, near Disney and stuff uh, in Anaheim and as much as I really like the jacket I don't like the texture of the jacket so this would be definitely one that I wouldn't want to wear but I think it looks fantastic this again would be something that you could I reckon you could wear to a wedding like you know take your jacket and stuff but seeing it's a thousand like wholeheartedly would know that they just do it in large so that would probably fit me but dear that's really it is a nice looking jacket if you had that, you had to have a waistcoat with it. Now I have one of these. Um, so was, yeah, I have this exact one. Um, I made sure that I bought this one because 
I know that I missed the first run of this as soon as they said uh, they were making them again. Bought it straight away because it looks fantastic. I love the one uh, one thing I will say about this. I may do a, a review on mine. Is I love the embroiderment on this one. I really want like for my Apple Watch. I really wanted something like that so I could put my my watch around it. Uh, this is the one thing I wanted because I think it looks cool. I love the leatherness. Um, yeah, it just looks so freaking cool. Look at that. Ah, oh, it's so nice. The just the the kind of the print of the Gokaija logo. Like I would go full deck out Gokaija. I've never actually worn mine to be fair. But I really like this. I as soon like when they first released it, I started looking around for like men's leather cuffs and stuff to get something similar because I thought it looked cool. Really nice box, so I definitely have mine. Ah, oh, look at that. That's so nice. That's so nice. And then the last one is Pat uh uh Patrin Green. I always keep calling it Patter Patter Ranger. Like, not Patrine. So again, this is the official one. They give you the, the measurements for it if you wanted to do it. And it looks awesome. I, I'm not a big fan of 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 the Pattern Rangers in that one, like the, the gear. So something for me not to wear. But I do like this. This is something that I would love to have as a, like a, oh, you know, if I was, to, like, you know, I'm the police type thing and here, here's my badge and stuff. That would look really nice. Yeah, that is really, really, really cool. Nice. I like the patch. I like the patch. The wheel. I never noticed that before. But yeah, this is really, really nice, to be fair. Like, it's an official product. So it's really nice if you wanted to get hold of all of these things. It's generally a really nice one. I mean, not going into all of them, but there are a lot of ones if you wanted to kind of buy them if you wanted to kind of add these things to your collections the tommy the tommy head okay i haven't seen this one so it's just the tommy headband uh tommy Ola green accessory power coin not included oh man like okay i get that but can you imagine if they did do it i'm not gonna <laughs> i don't think i'd get one because you know maybe they've matched it and found the, the right one there are tons and tons of pro uh, stuff on here that if you wanted to pick up i think that there is so much stuff that you could get like there's so much cool stuff on here that i generally kind of really really like um you know there's stuff that are obviously modeled by some of the uh actors you know that they've been in it obviously there's one at like say pal morph kind of thing um there are some here this is one right why like Whoa. Out of all the products on here, I think the one that I could never like is the Tricera Ranger chain. Like, not if you not unless you were doing like evil Billy or something, like Bling Billy or whatever. I don't know why it's there. I don't like it. It's not mine. But like there's so much cool stuff that you can get on here, which works really, really well. And you know, once stocks are gone, they're gone. Stocks, once the items are gone, they're gone. But generally, if you want to go have a look, like definitely go check it out there's some amazing stuff on here i'm gonna leave it here what are your thoughts on this would you pick up any of these items if you could which ones let me know down below in the comments i've seen two that i would definitely want uh, but yeah i am gonna leave it there thank you very much for watching this video this video is definitely not sponsored i just really wanted to showcase all of this because i think this is really cool so rich and nick have done absolutely amazing work and stuff like that so yeah go check it out uh tell me what you would get thank you very much for watching like favorite comment and subscribe check out the channel memberships if you want and with that i am going to leave it there thank you very much for watching once again and i will catch you in the next video i want to say a big thank you to all my patreon supporters and i wanted to shout out kimono cat your help does go a long way to support the channel and if you want to consider helping the channel then links to my patreon as well as the channel members are listed below ara ara channel wo support shite kurete ありがとうございます。チャンネル登録、高評価お願いします。